Hello everyone. I hope your preparation for GATE data science and AI exam is going well. So in this video, we are going to talk about the programming data structures and algorithm course. So what I have covered in this particular course and how it can be useful for your GATE and DA preparation part. Okay. So let's go to my website. So here you can see uh, piyushvarai.com. So just you can go to my website and you can uh, scroll down and you can explore my website for more courses for test series along with the combo pack and subject wise course as well. So here you can see our courses for gate data science and exam. If you click on view more, so you can see all the uh, courses like for every subject. Now in this video, we're going to talk about PDSA course that is programming data structures and algorithm. In the previous video, I already discussed what I have covered in the AI course. So if you have not watched that video, so you can watch that for the AI course. Okay. So let's discuss about the PDSA course first that is programming data structures and algorithm here. Right. So cost for this particular course is 500. But if you watch this video till end, I will give you some discount on this particular course. Okay. So here you can see what I have covered. Let's discuss that first. So introduction to programming in Python. So according to syllabus, whatever the content is there in the syllabus, I have completed all the syllabus here. So first we have started with the Python course first, right? So if you see introduction to Python course, I have discussed the basic of Python. What are variables? What is least? What is tuples? What are different data structures we have? Then different conditional statement, looping statement, functions, different types of functions. And most important thing is the recursion part. If you observe the previous year, a gate DA paper, there was two questions from recursion topic. So very, very important for gate DA point of view. Okay. I have discussed this thing in detail. So we can simply uh, refer to that. Then I have discussed in the second module. So first module is all about the programming part that is in Python part. So I have discussed the basic of Python, what is required for gate exam. And here you can see the exercises. So exercise consists of all the questions, what we have discussed in this particular uh, module, right? And if you see, I have also added the previous year solution from gate IDA paper. So there was three questions based on this Python. So I have discussed all the three questions here. So one question was based on pseudocode. But if you understand how this conditional statement work or while loop or for loop work, then you can easily solve all those type of questions, right? So I have discussed all the so all the questions from the previous year paper as well. Okay. Now let's discuss about the basic data structures that is second module. So in that I have discussed about introduction to data structures, array, queue, linked list, stack. So very important topic in the previous gate DA, there was one question based on this. So I have discussed those questions as well here, right? And then we have discussed linked list, type of linked list, a trees, binary search tree. And here you can see previous year questions from CSE branch as well. So if you see this PDSA course, most of the topics are there in the computer science uh, exam as well, but that is not used in Python, but concept remains the same. So if you see a previous year gate DA paper, they ask the question based on the concept part, right? So I have discussed the previous year gate CSE question as well, based on the few uh, topics here, right? And then we have exercise based on this particular uh, module and then the notes provided to you for your reference purpose, right? Now, next topic is search algorithm. So if you see the syllabus, first we have Python, then we have basic data structures and then we have search algorithm. Okay. So I will tell you how I have discussed this search algorithm as well. I will show you the demo video also, but let me discuss the content first. So here you can see search algorithm here. So linear search, binary search, one previous year gate question from this, we have discussed that and the nodes and the corresponding exercise is also present. Then we have discussed basic sorting algorithms. Everything is covered. Selection sort. So first I have discussed the concept. What is selection sort? Then I have discussed Python implementation of selection sort here along with the visualization. So we'll show you the demo video. Okay. And then we have discussed insertion sort, bubble sort in the similar manner. First concept, then visualization and then Python implementation. Right. So we have discussed all the things in the case of uh, algorithms part. Right. Same we have done for uh, binary search as well, linear search as well. And then we have uh, previous year gate uh, DA paper question. We have discussed that and then the notes for your reference, notes and the slides. In the next module, we have divide and conquer algorithms. For example, merge, sort, quick, sort, right? So we have discussed this thing in a similar fashion. First, I have discussed the concept, then visualization. Again, concept along visualization using Python. Right? So that thing we have discussed. And also we have discussed the previous year gate question as well. 
and here you can see the exercise for your practice purpose now this is about the python and the data structures part right now we have one important topic that is graph theory in our pdsa course very very important if you see a pdsa course or even in the case of ai we require this particular concept so i have discussed that thing in detail introduction to graph theory types of graph topological sorting so there was one question in the previous year gate da paper so here you can see that video solution and i have also discussed the previous year cac question as well based on this topological sorting then we have basic of graph traversal dfs bfs so same concept is there in the case of ai as well then we have spanning tree minimum spanning tree kruskal algorithm prims algorithm shortest path right so we have discussed all the algorithms concept along with the examples right and then we have exercise and slides for this particular module as well and then the last we have a tutorials right so whatever we have discussed that is a conceptual part required for gate exam along with few examples but here in the case of tutorials if you see here we have discussed a specific topic like bst traversal technique so there was one question based on this in the previous year gate da paper so based on that i have uploaded uh, this particular tutorials okay so i have completed almost all the syllabus for pdsa course you can refer to this uh, particular uh, content and i am going to keep uploading the tutorial as we have around two months now so i will keep uploading the videos of, as a part of tutorials right and then we have a note so you can download the notes here for data structures and algorithm so in the printable format you can download and take a print of that okay now next we have full subject test so there are five uh, tests so here you can see fst1 fst2 and i'm also providing the video solution of that so as of now just first two solution is there but we'll record for this uh, remaining as well okay so this is about the pdsa course i have discussed every uh, thing in detail along with the examples if you see i have covered almost all the syllabus here right along with the subject wise test series and the topic wise test as well as a part of pdsa course now let's go through the few sample videos like what i have said so if you can purchase this then you can continue for this course and you can see uh, this particular portal so on the left hand side you can discuss all the videos here like what we have uh, covered and to talk about the search algorithm what i said so linear search binary search we have discussed all the things sorting algorithm so here you can see selection sort so this is a video for selection sort so first i have discussed the uh, concept of selection sort here right how selection sort works then i have also uh, discussed let me show you so this is a concept theoretical uh, concept we have discussed in the next video we have discussed the python implementation here right so how it works in python what is the python code for this particular selection sort so i have discussed that thing in detail and and i have also shown the visualization here so if you just continue here you can see using python tutor i have discussed how that code is working right so on the right hand side you can see the visualization of that particular code how it is getting executed that is very important to understand in terms of data structures and algorithm how that code is getting executed in this particular uh, manner so that will really help you to understand how this particular algorithms are working okay i have discussed this python code first theoretically like using other uh, examples and then visualization is also there and at the last if you see here i have just shown you the visualization how this uh, sorting algorithm takes place right so this is how i have discussed all the algorithms in the sorting algorithm as well as in the divide and conquer uh, technique so first same thing about the merge sort i have discussed how uh, we work then the python implementation of uh, that we already uh, discussed this right and then visualization so once we discuss the python code then we have discussed the visualization here you can see so it will help you to understand the concept in a better way okay and this is about the course content uh, in a similar manner i have covered uh, remaining uh, topics so you can simply uh, go through that if you have any doubt while going through the content if you have doubt or if you have not understand the solution for any question so here you can see a course discussion if you click on course discussion so you can ask your doubt in our discussion forum i will you can tag me i will reply to your doubt or other students are also there to uh, you answer right so you can take a help of other student as well so this group discussion is for peer uh, learning okay so this is what we have covered in the pdsa course so if you are interested in purchasing this course as of now we are offering for 500 but you can use the code pdsa 
400 to get 100 rupees off. So you will get this particular PDSA course at just 400 rupees. Okay. Please remember the validity for this particular course and all the course is for first is till first of March only. Okay. So you can get entire thing at just 400 rupees along with the notes, printable notes. You can simply download that and you can get this PDSA course, right? So here you can see uh, the PDSA uh, course as well. So every notes are provided uh, to you. Okay. So you can simply take the print of this and you can uh, take it for your reference part. So that's it from this particular uh, video. I want to discuss what I have covered in the PDSA course. And if you are interested in purchasing this course, if you can just use my coupon code PDSA400 to get 100 rupees off and you can purchase this code at just 400 rupees. Okay. If you have any doubt regarding the course, you can simply comment below. I will reply to that. Okay. Thank you.